In this segment of the video, we will briefly discuss minor troubleshooting techniques for the catalyzer pump air motor. Remember, many problems have no relation to the air motor itself. Check these before checking pump air motor. Main air is connected to the pump, but the pump does not pressure up. Make sure that the main ball valve is open. Make sure that you're showing fluid pressure on the fluid pressure regulator. Check the quad valve mix guard control. Make sure it turns freely and is not in the up position. If it is in the up position, you will have to reprime the unit. See the priming section of the pump video. If the pump pressure is up but no material flows to the gun, check that the ball valve on the quad valve fluid outlet is open. If still no fluid flows to the gun, remove the tip and clean the tip and make sure it's not obstructed. Pull the trigger on the gun, see if you get any material flow. If you get no material flow at this point, you're going to have to check the fluid hose to see if the fluid hose is plugged or obstructed. Check the quad valve mix chamber is not obstructed by material. See the quad valve maintenance section in this video. If the catalyzer pump air motor stalls in the up position and air escapes from the exhaust ports, we'll have to remove the red cover and the four Allen screws to check and see if the magnet assembly or the aircraft nut has come loose. We do that by removing the red cover. We remove the four Allen screws on the exhaust cap. Remove the exhaust cap and the exhaust spacer. We push the piston to the up position. If you find that difficult, you may have to pull the trigger on the gun to relieve any pressure on the system for the magnet assembly and trip rod to push up into the up position. At this point, we use a quarter inch wrench to hold the trip rod. We're going to check and make sure that the magnet is tight on the trip rod and does not turn. We're also going to check that the aircraft nut on top of the magnet is tight and does not turn. If these are both tight, inspect the O-ring on the top of the magnet, the O-ring on the bottom of the magnet. On the servo piston, there's another O-ring. Make sure there's no cracks or breaks. If none of these options fix the pump at this point and it still leaks air and is stuck in the up position, go to our website and check on the air motor maintenance section. If you have any further questions, please feel free to call us at CAT for help.